Okay, in this video we're going to put in the code that actually closes the book. It wasn't a big deal, I just couldn't remember. But first off, all these warnings, I don't like them. So we're just going to add null to them. So they'll go away. I hope that'll be good enough. We'll see. Let's see if that took away some of them. Okay, let's do some more warnings. We're going to make these all equal to null too. Now, on Unity, whatever you put in here, um, it remembers the last thing that you did. Like, you can have a value here, but if you changed it in the instructor, it remembers that. So, so just because we're adding null, it's going to know that we actually have something there. Let's see. Let's get some more of those warnings out. Okay. Well, we're fixing the use close button, so that's okay. Before I get too carried away, let's make sure this still works for us. Then we've got our message. Okay, so let's close that. Let's go to the code. Let's go back to open book. And we're going to add another Boolean variable. Private bool is close. Click. Now then. Okay. So we come down here. We're going to take that out. So, um, we're going to say close click is true, and we're going to get the start time because we want to do the same thing with about the opening and closing as we did before. So, it was date time now, and um, we're going to give it a rotation, set the rotation vector. New zero negative one eight zero. Okay, what else do we need to do with this? Um, we can play our sound. In fact, we can move play sound below this. Okay, what else are we going to do? We're going to work on the update part of it. So instead of just is open clicked, we're going to say is open clicked or is close clicked. And looks like I've got a typo there. Now that looks better. So, so we're going to get the transform. We're start going to do the rotation, and we're going to get the date time. And um, first, we're going to check for if it's open click. Then we're just going to do this here. Else, we're not going to have it else. We're just going to check for it's close clicked. We could have done 
else, but we're not going to. Um, so, on this one we're going to also check the time. I'm going to copy that to save some typing, or at least this part of it. And then we're going to see. Okay, so I could have said if the start time and then say is closed and open, but you don't have to. And not only that, we might want to do something different, so I'm not. So we're going to say close clip equals false. What else are we going to do? Uh, close clip equals false. Um, Do we need to make any objects? Okay. Let's uh, run this and see what we need, else we need to do. Seems like we're going to need to set some objects active or not active. So, um, but let's just see what happens first, okay? Oh, sorry. I can't remember. So we've opened it. Now we're going to try to close it. Close it. Okay. <laughs> Let's see what's going on here. Let's stop it. Okay, now we're going to close it. Or we're going to see what else we need to do. I know we had not done enough. Okay, we did play sound. Um, okay, I see what I missed. Um, on the open book, we got closed. We've got the is closed. We forgot to set these game objects. Remember, we set those up. In the beginning, um, where this game object, we're going to say he's true, but the open book, remember, we set him up hip here, open book, and then we set him active and inactive. Um, but instead of doing it at the end, like this does, we have to do it first, okay? So let's go ahead and set it. Game object, set active, true, because remember we had him not active, and then we're going to say open book, set active, and false. Okay, I think that's all we're missing. We've got is closed, we've got the start time, we've got the location, and so let's come back over here. Okay, let's close it. Well, okay, so I need to do something with that bottom there. So we're going to stop this video now, and then in the next video, we will deal with that bottom. Okay, I think we just need to set him active too, so we might not wait for the whole video. Let's see what else we've got going on here. Close button. Inside back cover. Let's see all references of this. Find all references. Okay. Um, so we're going to set that one is true too. Let's 
basically we're just doing the opposite of what we did up there seems like it's so long ago that we did it but it was just this morning so it's that end kind of true okay so let's try it again Okay, let's open it again. Previous. Let's close it again. Okay, guys. So we have got a flip book. Now you can call this quit if you want. Or in the later videos, I'm going to show you how to place words on there. Okay? So keep tuned. And it might even be today. Bye.